Okay, so you've got some oil and you've got some water, and I'm just going to draw for you very quickly how um, the emulsifier less thin holds um, water droplets away from each other, if you like, or keeps them apart. Um, so let's get ready. Okay, so let's have some yellow that will represent our oil. And uh, when we made our mayonnaise, we had loads and loads and loads of oil and a few droplets of vinegar. Okay, vinegar or water, it doesn't really matter. So we've got loads of oil. We used sunflower oil, which is a sort of yellowy colour. And then we had some little water droplets as well. So here's my water droplets in there, just like we've got over here. Okay, and what I'm going to try and do is just show you exactly what these emulsifiers do. Okay, and the emulsifiers from the egg yolk, so you know, we've got like uh, somewhere over there, we've got an egg, and you know, there's the egg yolk. And from that, we get a little chemical uh, called lecithin, which we're going to pretend looks a little bit like that. Okay, and this end, okay, uh, absolutely uh, loves water. Okay, and this end, okay, hates water. Okay, so that's hydrophobic. It hates water, and this end, because it loves it, is uh, hydrophilic. Okay, so very very quickly, this is what happens to stop um, these little water molecules here joining up again and uh, forming two layers of oil and water. Um, you get loads of these little lesser thin molecules, okay, and they're everywhere, okay. So the heads are the bit that like the water, and the tail bits are the bits that like the oil. Now what happens is that the head bits find their way into the water droplets, and they completely surround each water droplet really, really easily. There's a little one there. So you can imagine them being all the way around here and they absolutely cram pack themselves. So each water droplet ends up completely surrounded by these um, emulsifiers, lecithin it's called. Okay, and because the water droplets are surrounded by them, they can no longer ever join up to make a big water droplet and big water droplets anywhere else simply cannot join up with other big water droplets to make bigger water droplets and eventually settle back out into two layers. So this end, okay, that sticks in the oil, that sticks in the water and the whole thing is uh, stopped from going back to two different layers. And what happens is if you beat up all the little uh, bits of water into these tiny and tiny droplets, uh, they just stay together. Um, they just stay as a fine, fine droplets in amongst the oil, and that's basically what mayonnaise is.